we are still waiting at Burbank. It's 12 o'clock. Uh, but look, Comfort, my turn's coming up. Uber X, my turn's coming up. Uber XL, my turn's coming up because a couple of flights landed. So it wasn't 11. These flights came a little bit late. I understand that, right? 11 sometimes could mean 12. This is why it's always important to come to the uh, airport and stay a little bit after. Now, here's the thing. My last video that I paused and I walked around, you guys got to check it out. In my last video, I showed that Uber took me off the queue and sometimes I used to panic, but not anymore. I got out of my car, I started walking around and when I started moving, um, the algorithm put me back in the queue. But when the first time that happened to me, it freaked me out. Definitely check out the last video in the playlist, guys. Okay, that's the first one that popped up. That's going to take 20 minutes and probably another 15 to come back. That's half an hour's worth of work. It's offering $9. Now I'm cool. Okay, here's the second one that popped up. $16 is a little bit more to go where? 26 minutes. That means it's gonna take 46 minutes for $16, that's bad. So it's basically 45 minutes, new customer with a 5.0, and Kohanga and Yucca Street, Los Angeles, probably North Hollywood, or yeah, it's eight miles, probably, yeah. We can do something better. Okay, look at this. This is the third one that popped up. This is 18 minutes. That's not bad. So I can get back to the airport queue. But no, we're going to remember the trick. You have to say no to all of this little stuff. Because for me, you have to understand, I have Excel, right? I can wait and wait for an Excel ride and make the same amount of money. So I'm not going to risk it. Uh, and I'll fall at the end of Comfort. I'll fall at the end of Uber X because I'm still working in the background. Literally, in the background, I am uploading a video for you guys right now part five of the container series and this is how we do it my friends okay another shitty ride we're not gonna do it i'm not even gonna look at it it's not even worth it and they'll threaten to put me at the end of the container or at the end of the queue that's fine we'll wait for the second wave of flights now this is what i mean i'll turn my face on for this let all the other drivers take these crappy $7 rides, $8 rides, $12 rides. That's fine. We're going to sit here and either land in Uber Excel. Um, if not, then we're going to get put at the end of Comfort, at the end of Uber X, and we'll come back. And Uber Comfort is people that have money. And if you notice earlier, there was more people taking Uber Comfort out here than Uber X. And I'm very patient. Now I uploaded one more long video. I'm going to go upload another long video in the background. Check it out. This video is being uploaded right now that I just finished talking about how to deal with the Burbank airport queue is full. And at the end, you'll see what, what happens because this is an issue people are going to run into. And the same video right now is going to get uploaded on my other account. I'm not wasting any time. Okay, it's popped up with another one. $16 West Hollywood. Um, I'm thinking, no, it's all streets. It's all streets. Yucca. See, earlier I saw that street, Yucca. I remember that. And that's okay. Let's see how far it pushed us back. Remember, guys, be patient. Don't be threatened by all these stupid games that they play with you. Look at how much it pushed you back. 36 out of 40, no problem. By the time my Uber X goes out and uh, Uber XL goes out, if I don't get the ride that I want, I'll be back in line for Uber Comfort. This is my style of driving, cherry picking. Yes, I've been here 45 minutes, but I have a backup plan, right? And my backup plan is this. In the background, keep uploading videos, right? I'm literally in, in the process of uploading a new video and I'm changing the titles on it. And this is why Uber can't get me anymore, okay? Because I have a backup plan, because I'm doing something else in the background, I'm in not in a rush. Look, the guy next to me took, he probably, the guy next to me probably took that $18 ride. And that's okay. We're going to sit here. We're going to wait for Uber Excel and get paid what we're worth. All right. I'm going to pause this and let you know if another one pops up. Okay. By the way, this is the place list you want to focus on. It's gotten about 88 videos in the last three months. 
I have two channels, so I'll show you both the playlists because we're still waiting. I moved my car around, it was too hot over there. So I turned it around, I went back. Now I can see um, um, the Burbank airport and the people that were next to me are gone. The people next to me here is gone. There's a new guy that parked where I'm at. There's places to park, uh, which means there's less people here. So all those rides that were popping up that I passed on, everybody took those $7, $10, $7, that's fine. I'm hoping when the next wave comes from Uber, I'll get something better. If not, I just got another hour to spend on my YouTube channel. There's one more thing I wanna do right now is, yeah, let me show you the other channel. So this is one playlist right here that I want you to follow. Daily Uber updates or uh, type in pound maximizing Uber earnings. It's got 88 videos on it. And on my other channel, it's called a little bit something different. So let me show you what it's called on the other channel. On my second YouTube channel, this is gonna be my main channel for just Uber stuff, right? Over here, the same playlist is called what? There you go. So over here, this playlist is called Pound Rideshare Podcast. I'm gonna turn it into a podcast pretty soon. And maximizing Uber earnings, it shows up but without the hashtag. And that's just two different way of me pushing the same content. It's literally the same content. I just decided, like if you notice over here, there's 46, 47 videos, meaning there's less videos on this channel because about two months ago, I started pushing this. Before that, I was putting everything on the other channel. And I don't know, I just want one channel to be all Uber stuff. Okay, let's see what happens on the queue. I'll keep you posted. All right, um, comfort has gone down a little bit. Uber X and Uber XL hasn't been pushed much, but that means a flight came, everybody went, it's like a wave, right? Now we're gonna wait another five, 10 minutes for more flights to come in. And I also think there's a delay. I personally think because Burbank Airport only has one way to go in, right? So what Uber does is it allows a wave of cars to go and then after 5-10 minutes a wave of cars has gone then it releases it for, to more people because I've seen literally in um, I've, I don't know, people are looking inside my car they're watching me talk to myself they probably think I'm crazy and I've literally seen at this morning at LAX there was 200 people waiting but there was only 10 cars there that doesn't make any sense but it makes sense for the Uber algorithm. The algorithm wants what? Supply and demand and push the surge uh, so it can make more money. Over here, it's probably doing the same thing, but it's not a surge. I think, oh, there you go, UberX, my turn's coming up. I think over here, it's more of an issue of traffic because um, there's too many people dropping off. There's one lane to go in to pick up people at Burbank. And when the drivers are there picking up the passengers, those 10 or 15, or 20 whatever it released have to clear in order for the next wave to come through so now you can see my turns coming up on uber x comfort is going down uber xl has been the same that means because my acceptance rate is low maybe it's, it's it's like just not allowing me to get it or people aren't really ordering uber xl and it's all good i'll keep you posted i think next is going to be probably me taking a ride because i've already spent about an hour here I've worked on my channel, I've gone to the bathroom, and now I'm gonna pray and meditate a little bit and get ready for the next passenger. Meaning I've gotten my break and I've worked on my main business, which is YouTube um, and podcasting, and now I'm ready for a passenger. I ended up going in the back of Uber XQ because I missed a couple because my sound wasn't on so I couldn't hear it. Now that I know it's full and I've gone back on Comfort, I've gone back on Uber XL. Um, oh, I haven't gone on Uber XL. Now when the next con uh, Comfort ride comes, I'll probably take it. And you can see over here, I'm still working. I'm still working on my, um, you know, the five videos that I uploaded today and I'm fixing it up, fixing up the title, so I'm not worried. Um, and I'm taking a break. Are you stopped? Your rider may cancel this trip if you don't, what? I never took anybody. That doesn't make any sense. I'm not even in the ride, I'm just working. Look at that, look at that bullshit. What was that? Are you stopped? That doesn't make any sense. I've never seen that. It, it, the algorithm doesn't even want me to work in the background. This is weird. Look, I'm literally, literally sitting here working on this. 
working on my description and it gave me this stupid error like are you stopped which makes no sense okay anyways I'm gonna oh my god Woo, it's getting worse now we're not gonna take that okay check it out on my main channel it's gonna say understanding the uber algorithm container part one two three four five and this video will be part six um, and then on my backup channel or my second channel let's go to real fast the naming is slightly different if you go over here and we look um, I just left it loose I haven't updated this one so when I get a chance I'll update these because right here the last videos are just completely different I'm just trying to see which videos are doing good which videos are not but if you look right here this one's already gotten about 119 views right so that what is a container how does it work with uber might be the the, the new way of me doing it on this channel because each one each video and each on each youtube channel i'll do it slightly different um okay so let me go over here and copy this into memory and show you exactly what i'm doing because we're still waiting for uber in the background i'm going to copy this because the way this is written is looking good okay and then we're going to go and check uber real fast Ah, oh, nothing's moved okay we're going to go over here and that's what i ended up using on my other channel as a title and and a, and a thing for the series so in this one it'll be what is a container and how does it work with uber driving right question mark and then it can do something like let's go over here there you go and it'll be slightly different so on this one it's going to be like this container part one boom what is a container and how does it work with uber driving so i'll make this bigger okay that's it so this is basically the new now i'll go update it until our turn comes in uber perfecto now this one is updated also look part one part two part three part four part five the only thing that's left is over here, the thumbnails. And that's basically what I'm going to work on next. And let's see what's going on. Okay, nothing much is going on. Um, all right, I got to stop working. I got to take a passenger now. We got to make some money. So, and the airport is filling up again. But, you know, last hour and a half, I've just worked on my YouTube channel. This is the sixth video. I'm going to go ahead and upload this. And... Um, I guess what you're going to learn in this is sometimes saying no too many times is not a good idea. Okay. So in this situation, I think I've been put at the back of Uber Comfort once, back of Uber X once. Excel hasn't changed. It's still six out of 10, which means the whole hour and a half I've been waiting here, I'm still on top of Uber Excel. So when the next wave of flights comes in, I might be okay. But most likely because I've worked, I spent an hour and a half. The, the airport is starting to clog up again. I'll probably take a $15, $20 ride and get out and then start doing something else, right? Um, and I've done enough work for today. Other than the thumbnails, uh, my main thing, which is YouTube channel, um, it's doing good, right? So I guess that's the lesson from here is not all the time you can get lucky. Like sometimes when I notice it was showing 11 o'clock, all these flights are coming and I got here. Um, I got here by 11.15. Now, I've been here two hours, 15 minutes spent driving here. Um, I would say hour and a half sitting here and working. Um, it's, it's a hit or a miss. But if you look at my numbers, 9 out of 10 times, I'm able to make at least $200. Like, let me show you. Then we'll end the video right here. Actually, that's the next video. I'm going to post this as a container video. So look, yesterday, I had no problem driving this way and making $300. Granted, it was New Year's, it was busy. Today should have been busy too, but maybe I made a bad guess, it's okay. Um, it is what it is. Let me go ahead and upload this video as the fifth video or sixth video in the container series. And I guess by the end of this video, you'll know like, hey, sometimes if you say no to too many rides, it's not good and it puts you in prison. That's the lesson here. But please like, comment, and subscribe because I make mistakes and I even tell you the mistakes that I make because we can learn in every situation. I'll start another video because this one's been 15 minutes long.